Flamio Hotman, I have some interesting details on Avatar Kyoshi's role in Netflix Avatar The Last Airbender live action today. And that's all thanks to Yvonne Chapman, who's the actress playing Avatar Kyoshi. She recently gave an interview where she shared some insights, and that's what we're going to look at together today in this video. Here's the extract from the magazine, thanks to Avatar News for sharing this. You can see she says she's really curious to see what it's going to look like, but at the moment she's in the dark like everyone else. A lot of cast members have been saying the same, which kind of supports the notion of the latest update being the series is still in post-production. You also see she heaps a lot of praise on Ang actor Gordon Cormier, which is a good sign. Ang goes through such a range of emotions in the animated Last Airbender series, so it's important to have an actor that can portray that emotion in the live action series. Yvonne then goes on to say that the showrunners and creators have such a passion for the story. Which is interesting, it's exactly what James C, the cabbage merchant, said a little while ago. And generally, a creative team that actually likes and understands the source material, in theory has a better chance of making a good series. She then goes on to say that they were all fans of the series growing up, so there's a great deal of respect for the source material, and they've kept in mind the audience that's going to be watching has grown up with the show. Again, we know Netflix insiders have said they want to respect the source material, but it's interesting to see Yvonne talk about it, and you'll notice she says respect, and doesn't use words like replicate, copy, or follow the source material. And the reason I pick out that specifically is because there have been some mixed reports in the community, with some thinking that Netflix were trying to do a direct copy of the animated series, while others thinking it will go beyond that and introduce other aspects, as well as having a slightly darker tone. So I think the words Yvonne uses here does kind of suggest that we can expect new aspects or at least expanded parts of the story, and you'll see more of that in the next part if we look at what else she says, particularly around the difference in the role Kyoshi could play in the live action series. She says Kyoshi will be a source of tough love for Aang, she sometimes has a different perspective from the other avatars, she's a very fierce person, and she's going to be able to guide Aang in what needs to be done in his circumstances. Kyoshi's going to be able to give Aang the advice he needs to hear at the time he needs to hear it. Now this is exciting, and it's kind of the first insider details we've had on Kyoshi's role in Netflix Avatar The Last Airbender. Now if you think back to the original series, Kyoshi didn't really have much of a role in season 1. She also didn't really give Aang that much advice in the series at all. Apart from that stuff with Chin the Conqueror, and also at the end of season 3 for about 30 seconds, she gave some advice on how to deal with Ozai. However, from Yvonne's words here, it seems like Kyoshi will play a larger role in advising Aang in Netflix live action adaption. I have a feeling she'll have a bigger role from the moment they set foot on Kyoshi Island, and maybe she'll play some kind of joint role with Roku. Obviously Roku was a bit more of an advisor in the original animated series, but it sounds like Kyoshi will be sharing some of that burden in the live action adaption from Netflix. Interestingly, Yvonne also talks about Kyoshi being fierce, Now I'm pretty sure Kyoshi would have killed Ozai, and she said as much to Aang, so I wonder if this bigger role for Kyoshi means Aang's personality and actions as an avatar through the live action series might be slightly different to the animation. So that's some insight on the role Kyoshi could be playing in Netflix Avatar The Last Airbender live action. Let me know in the comments what you think about Kyoshi having a bigger role in Netflix Avatar The Last Airbender. For now though, don't forget to like and subscribe. I hear there could be an update from Netflix next week on the release date of this live action Avatar The Last Airbender series. So if you like and subscribe, I'll be able to keep you up to date. For now though, thank you for watching and I'll catch you later.